A volunteer ambulance company in Luzerne County needs some help, both with the property's landscaping and recruiting more EMTs. Newswatch 16's Allie Gallo shows us who or what showed up in response. Volunteer first responders with Pond Hill Lily Lake Ambulance recruited some new volunteers, but they're not EMTs. Yeah, that was so grown up, there was no way we could get in there. So we came over, we looked, and I said, yeah, the goats would love to come over and eat this. And, you know, it's just a block away from the, uh, from the farm, if you will. The volunteer ambulance company in Wapwalapin is required to have trees planted next to its building so neighbors aren't disturbed by the lights. But the trees can't be planted until all of this overgrown brush is gone. He asked me how much, and I said, no, I'm not going to charge you to do this. We can, we, we can do this for you. The goats will, they like to eat. The generous offer couldn't have come at a better time for volunteers with the ambulance company. The team of four is struggling keeping up and needs more volunteer EMTs. But it's hard. There's a lot of regulations, and it isn't the easiest thing to get anymore. So until those volunteers come, Joe Kabricki will keep the ambulance company's property up to the county standard. After eight hours of trying to clear the brush, he and his wife didn't seem to get anywhere. It was too big of a job, but not a problem for these eight goats. Goats clear brush. They clear, uh, they clear lots of good stuff out. I never thought goats could do something like this. It has even become a learning experience for folks who stop by to watch the goats at work. Vic has taught all of the neighbors about what goats don't and do like to eat. Thistle, pricker bushes, poison ivy, poison oak, things that us humans don't want to touch. The goats don't mind a light rain like what it's doing right now, but when it starts to rain harder, they'll go back home to their barn. And right on cue, the rain picked up and the goats ran towards home. They'll be right back out here eating, though, once the rain stops. Allie Gallo, Newswatch 16, Luzerne County.